remember that where you you were very young in 1967. I didn't see the one. 1970. I, I, I didn't see you. That is why you are talking like this. I think. Uh, I know you said, how old are you? Yeah. I'm 86. You said the war. Are you listening? Okay. I was made Archbishop two days before that war began. Mm -hmm. Only chap, where I was Archbishop is the city most destroyed. Where did that come from? Israel. 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 So, I know what I am saying. I have known Alex Equimel before that. Now, it is those who did not see the Nigeria Biafra war who are talking about the Republic of Biafra. They have no idea. They are poets. They do not know the political difficulties. Ujuku was very intelligent and brilliant. Ujuku was very capable. And that time, he had the whole Eastern Nigeria. He was the head of the army. He did his best. Unfortunately, Nigeria federal government had supported. Britain, United States, and Russia, all of them, the big powers, they had arms. So Biafra said we are being persecuted, but Biafra could not defend itself in the battlefield. They did it best, but it was defeated. Have you ever read the Bible, Cain and Abel? Yeah. In the Cain, Abel was a holy man. Cain was not holy. Cain said, let's go for a war. Abel was a good man. Did they return from the war? No. <laughs> you see? You see? So the, the fact that you are innocent does not mean you will win in the battlefield. You may win or you may not win. That is in the political area. So even good people suffer, like Abel. And he was killed. We don't want to fight the war anymore. No, we need I don't like fighting. Fight fighting is a terrible thing. We want to fight for him. What do you Are you listening? For a referendum, you join a political party and you speak about it and you will win in the parliament in Abuja.